Whosoever is a devout lover of God, let him enjoy this beautiful, bright festival. And whosoever is a grateful servant, let him rejoice and enter into the joy of his Lord. And if any be weary with fasting, let him now receive his reward. If any have labored from the first hour, let him receive his due reward. If any have come at the third hour, let him with gratitude join the feast. If any have arrived at the sixth hour, let him not doubt, for he too shall sustain no loss. And if any have delayed to the ninth hour, let him not be afraid by reason of his delay, for the Lord is gracious and receives the last, even as the first. He gives rest to him that comes at the eleventh hour, as well as to him that toiled from the first. Yes, to this one he gives, and upon that one he bestows. He accepts works and greets the endeavor that one he bestows. He accepts works and greets the endeavor, the deed he honors and the intention he commends. Let all then enter into the joy of our Lord, you first and you last, receiving alike your reward, you rich and you poor, rejoice together. You sober and you slothful, celebrate the day. You that have kept the fast and you that have not, Rejoice today, for the table is richly laden. Feast sumptuously on it. The calf is a fatted one. Let no one go away hungry. Partake you all of the cup of faith. Enjoy you all the riches of his goodness. Let no one grieve at his poverty, for the universal kingdom has been revealed. Let no one mourn that he has fallen again and again, for forgiveness has risen from the tomb. Let no one fear death. For death of our Savior has set us free. He has destroyed it by enduring it. He despoiled Hades when he descended there too. He vexed it even as he tasted it of his flesh. Isaiah foretold this when he cried, Thou, O Hades, has been vexed. It is vexed. By encountering him below. It is vexed. It is vexed. For it has been done away with. It is vexed. It is vexed. For it has been made a mockery. It is vexed. It is vexed. For it is destroyed. It is vexed. It is vexed. For it is annihilated. It is vexed. It is vexed. For it is now made captive. It took a body and discovered God. It took earth and encountered heaven. It took what it saw and was overcome by what it did not see. O oh, death, where is your sting? O oh, Hades, where is your victory? Christ is risen. Christ is risen. And you are annihilated. Christ, Christ is, is risen. Christ is risen. And the evil ones are cast down. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. And the angels rejoice. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. And life is liberated. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. And the tomb is emptied of the dead. For Christ is risen from the dead is become the first fruits of those who had fallen asleep. To him be glory and power forever and ever. Amen. Oh.